Hi, I'm Shy Fox, and in this tutorial, I'm going to help you figure out why your art tablet is drawing a dot after a line. To demonstrate this issue, it looks like this. And for many of your lines, maybe not every line you draw, but some of your lines are getting this dot at the end. I'll take you through my troubleshooting process and show you things I tried in case one of these things uh, solves it for you. And I'll give you my solution at the end as well and explain why this may be happening. So with some experimentation, I noticed it mainly happened when I was using a drawing brush with a high stabilizer or smoothing setting. It shouldn't really be doing this at all. So this isn't normal ever for, you know, even using stabilizing and smoothing tools. It shouldn't do this. Um, I tried playing with the stabilizer settings to see what I could figure out from that. All I concluded was it was more likely to happen with a higher stabilizer or higher smoothing setting, but I greatly prefer this to be higher when I'm doing my line art. So I needed to fix it to use my line art brushes for max smoothness uh, the way I intended to use it. I noticed the line issue wasn't pen specific. It was happening to all of my brushes. I tested different brushes. And uh, if you suspect it was only one particular brush, you could try to reset the brush's original settings, uh, but it was happening to any brush with high stabilization. Next, I saw I had a CSP update. Clip Studio Paints the program I'm using. So I updated the program, tested it. That didn't fix my issue, but worth, you know, checking all of these things, updating, updates, all that. Uh, I tested the tablet drivers in the tablet settings. So pulled up my tablet menu and uh, it didn't seem to test well in there. Red flag uh, that this may say more about the issue. Uh, so I next decided to uninstall and reinstall the tablet drivers. That initially was not successful at this point and it did not work. Mind you, I had the drivers saved on my PC and uninstalled and reinstalled those same drivers rather than going to the website to get the latest version of the drivers. This was a mistake. So coming back to that point in a moment, I tried going to file, uh, this is in Clip Studio Paint. I tried going to file pen pressure and resetting it in Clip Studio Paint, as you see here, um, that didn't work. I tried to recalibrate in the tablet menu and uh, that didn't work, maybe worth trying. I tried going to the control panel, pen settings, and then right click press and hold, turn that off. So I tried to, I, I turned off the right click, press and hold. Uh, online, you know, looking for answers said, this could be an issue causing the dot problem worth mentioning to you as well, since uh, it may be your solution. Uh, so do check that. This causes your computer to potentially think you're holding your stroke and, it, and that you're trying to right click. So you can uncheck that so it doesn't think you're trying to right click. Uh, you could also uninstall and reinstall your art program. I didn't try that. I was troubleshooting otherwise, but just a thought, uninstall and reinstall your program, but maybe don't do that as of yet. Let's get through to the actual solution. More likely is your issue. Then I considered that there could be something causing my computer to lag because it was almost like this lag effect. It would like drag at the end, stutter and do a dot and could cause the dot issue. So if your computer had like low memory, you can check that in your task manager. Uh, could be caused by a C drive being full. You can clean up your C drive, run a disk cleanup, uninstall some, you know, programs and apps you're not using on your C drive, put them on a different drive even. Another thing I tried to narrow down what the issue was, was I tested the issue in a whole other drawing program. I pulled out Photoshop, turned up the smoothness um, setting, and it actually still had the problem. So you can see that the problem was the same. So same problem, it's not an art program problem, rules that out. Digging online for more answers, I came across a tip that sometimes when installing a new driver does not fix the issue, installing a slightly older driver may work. Um, that made me think I probably didn't have the newest driver. So I went to get the latest driver and also need to be sure we have the correct driver for the exact drawing tablet model. You have the wrong model, you might have a problem. I was having a problem uninstalling them. I do have a video on if you can't uninstall a driver and reinstall new ones on what to do. Literally went back to my tutorial to figure out how, long story short, 
that wintab32.dll file must be deleted in, in uh, the uninstallation process to be able to put new tablet drivers back on your computer. Your computer only allows one set of tablet drivers on at one time, more specifically that wintab32.dll file. So go check that video if you're unable to uninstall and reinstall tablet drivers. And I noticed the panel for the pen tablet was different than it was before. So I was definitely using a different version of drivers. <laughs> Whatever I had before was either too outdated or literally the wrong one. My tablet is so old that I had to go digging for the drivers online, but found them nonetheless. I was literally expecting this to just completely solve the issue. It didn't solve it completely, but it was much better. This is what happened. It was the same at first with the dots still happening but I turned up the tablet settings for pen sensitivity in my tablet menu. It makes sense that the sensitivity needs to be increased for the slow strokes. And it worked way better after I did that. Um, I had to actually try a lot harder then to get the dot thing to occur. It did occur when I tried sometimes, mainly for doing strokes that were too quick. The progress with this literally does make me think that the issue truly lies with the tablet and the tablet drivers itself, not the PC, not the art program. I could live with it like this. It is so much better. It would mean I need to reduce my stabilizer if it's happening too much as I'm drawing faster than the program would like me to for those pen settings. But I wasn't 100% satisfied and wanted to check one last thing. So I tried installing a totally different art tablet altogether. I have a Huey on lying around to compare uh, to see if it's the tablet the other tablet no issue so confirm for certain it was the the tablet in my case the original tablet i think it all comes down to three crucial things as a solution for you first of all outdated drivers or you may even have the wrong drivers altogether so definitely uninstall and download the current version of your correct compatible drivers Second, your pen pressure settings, turn them all the way up in your tablet menu. This seemed to help me immensely, at least experiment with the difference. And thirdly, you're drawing too quickly with too high of a stabilizer or smoothing setting. So retry the strokes with a reduced smoothness stabilizer. And this is if you intend to make quicker strokes. You shouldn't have a super high smoothness on if you're trying to draw quicker. One last thing you could try if that doesn't give you clarity is to try installing your tablet with the issue on a different computer altogether with the same up-to-date drivers and see if the issue still occurs, especially if you only have one tablet and can't test a second one. That way you can 100% be sure if it is in fact that specific tablet um, to, to blame or tablet drivers anyhow. If it doesn't occur on the new PC and it's some combination of your tablet with the original PC, then that is where I'm at a bit of a loss for you. If the issue persists to an absolute annoying degree, you could ultimately replace your tablet. Your tablet could be too old, too outdated for current PC software. Well, I hope that gives you some ideas. Please comment with your success story you know, I hope, or a thanks if this helps you and leave a like and subscribe for more digital art tutorials and tech problem solving tutorials like this one. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.